Hey everybody, this is Jason Akers with Green Acres Pest Control. And I want to go over something that has that I have had to address many, many, many times. Now, I make myself available to pretty much anyone who contacts me. Um, I have people contact me through YouTube right here. I have people contact me through Facebook. Uh, my website, greenacrespc.com, that's A-K-E-R-S, that's how you spell my last name. People go there, people get me on Facebook at Green Acres Pest Control LLC. I get messages all the time, and one of the most common things that people ask me is, well, first I want to get this out there. I uh, do a lot of bed bug work. I have a lot of bed bug uh, questions that I answer um, <clears throat> in my YouTube videos. I have an entire playlist, which this video is going to be added to. Um, on, you know, how to properly treat for bed bugs. Now, in the comment section below, I am going to link a video showing how I treat a home for bed bugs. Um, the, back to the question, though, that people ask me is, uh, it's not unknown <clears throat> that I promote the use of Crossfire to eliminate bed bugs. Crossfire is a pesticide that's produced by MGK, out of uh, Minneapolis. It's a very successful pesticide to kill bed bugs. It, it works. It just really works. It really works well. Uh, you can purchase Crossfire online. You can get it on Amazon. Uh, you can find it on, you know, do it yourself type pest control websites where you can buy pesticides. Uh, you do not have to have a license to buy it unless you live in New York and then you have to be a licensed professional. Now I don't know how long it's going to go on that way if you're going to be able to buy it forever or if you're going to eventually have to hire somebody but um, the main reason that I advise people to use Crossfire is because it's more successful than heat treatments. Um, heat treatments are very up in the air. There's not very good science behind them. I mean, I know heat kills bed bugs. Yeah, if you throw your laundry in the washing machine and they can't get away, then yes, it will kill bed bugs. But when it comes to your home, your home is very porous. There's lots of places they can run and hide. And so heat is, and it's extremely expensive. Not a lot of people can afford it. And, you know, at the price tag that you spend on a heat treatment, typically they're just not worth the money. And a lot of people contact me wanting to know alternatives. Um, and like I said, Crossfire is what I typically advise people to buy. It's a very low toxicity to mammals. You don't even have to wear gloves when you mix it. Now, that's at the time of this video. But, you know, that could change. Labels change. Always read your label. Always follow your label. Now, it specifically states on the Crossfire label that you are not supposed to use it for a broadcast application. Now, for people who aren't uh, pest control technicians or professionals, may not understand the terms used on the label, and that's what this video is about. Um, a crack and crevice treatment, which is what I tell everybody to do to eliminate bed bugs, is you treat your baseboards throughout the house in the cracks behind the baseboards. You treat crown molding around the cracks where the crown molding meets the sheetrock, you know, up around the top of your ceiling. Um, you treat, you know, uh, wall void cracks and stuff. Just any crack and crevice. If you have to ask yourself, should I treat in that crack? Go ahead and do it. That's what a crack and crevice treatment is. Now, you can treat your bed. You can treat your box spring. You open up the box spring underneath and you treat all inside the box spring, all around the box spring. Treat the seams especially uh, where it's sewn together. Uh, also where it pleats on the corners. You want to make sure you treat in the pleats really well. You want to treat around that little piece of plastic around every corner. You know, a box spring typically has little four uh, corner protectors. They're made of plastic and they're stapled to the bottom of the bed. You want to treat behind those, in those. Um, those are the places you really want to target and make sure you treat really well with Crossfire. Now, the rest of your house, you just treat crack and crevice through the rest of the house. Don't spray your carpets. Don't spray your hardwood floors. Don't worry about treating every little inch because that's not how you're supposed to use it. That's not the most effective way to use it. The most effective way to use Crossfire is in the cracks and the crevices of your home. That's where the bed bugs live. And another question I get asked is, well, what about boxes? What about furniture? What about uh, clothes? I have boxes of clothes or I have stored stuff in my closet. 
What about if bed bugs get in that stuff? What do I do? And in some really extreme cases, the bed bugs will be living in those places. If you really feel that it's important to treat those areas, remove all the clothing, wash your clothing, and treat in your nightstand tables, you know, your your uh, drawers and stuff, but just the cracks. You don't need to treat everything. You just treat the cracks where the wood joins with wood in those little cracks in the joints of the drawers. That's where you treat. You don't need to treat everything, just the cracks. So I hope this video has answered questions that a lot of people have about how to properly treat. Like I said, I'm going to link a video below. It's it's actually, you can find it on YouTube. It's called The Most Extensive Bed Bug Treatment on YouTube. And the reason I titled it that way is because nobody is willing to tell you how to spray for bed bugs. Everyone wants to push heat. Everyone wants to say, well, you need to use a, a heat treatment or a freeze treatment. Or they don't want to tell you exactly how to apply the chemical, but... Like I said, I promote Crossfire. I don't get paid by MGK. They don't give me any kind of commission from selling their product. I don't give links, you know, like Amazon links or anything like that. No one pays me. You know, a lot of these exterminators you see on YouTube, uh, you know, there's one guy on YouTube that I won't mention his name because I'm not going to promote him, but he uh, he sells like mouse traps and stuff and if you go and you watch his YouTube videos, he's just all about mice and try to kill mice. And, oh, you could go to this link on Amazon and buy this uh, mouse trap, And then he gets a percentage. He gets a kickback. I don't get kickbacks. I just tell people, hey, Crossfire is what I use. And it works really, really well. If for some reason Crossfire quits working, I'll figure out what works. I will tell you. You know, so subscribe to my channel if you really are concerned about bugs getting in your house, bed bugs, cockroaches, silverfish, spiders, mice, rats, possums, skunks, you name it. I try to tell you anything that you need to know. If you have any questions at all, don't hesitate to leave me a comment below. If you need, uh, you know, some anonymity, you don't want people to know who you are, you're more than happy, more than welcome to send me a private message over on Facebook. You can uh, also tweet me pictures at GreenAcresPC on uh, Twitter, and I will try my best to identify the bugs. I've seen a lot of bugs in 30 years. I know most of them, what they are, what they look like. Uh, so, you know, if you have any questions, if you're worried that you might have bed bugs, but you're not sure, you could send me a picture. Um, so, but anyway, hopefully this has been a helpful video. I really hope that you guys understand that it's not that hard to get rid of bed bugs it's really just about where you treat, you know, do a crack and crevice treatment, be really thorough. Like I said, if you have to ask, uh, treat the crack. Also, I want to mention something too. When you go to Amazon and you're buying pesticide, you're buying Crossfire, there's three different um, volume that, that you could buy. As a consumer, you're going to want to buy the 13 ounce bottle. It's like $50 or less. It's, it's right around that that price range. Um, don't buy the aerosol. The aerosol is not effective. It's really only to chase them out. It's not really used as a residual. It's more of a flushing agent, so you're flushing them out with it, but it's not really used like the Crossfire liquid. You take the 13 ounces and you mix it to one gallon of water, and that is your finished product. That is what you're going to use in your house. You're not going to use the concentrate plain you're going to use the concentrate mixed into water. Now, 13 ounces, I know it sounds like a lot, but that's the way the label says it's 13 ounces to a gallon. Um, if you're concerned that you may not use a whole gallon, uh, then, you know, you can get those little half-gallon sprayers at, like, uh, Ace Hardware or, um, you know, different, like, tractor stores and stuff, southern stores and things where you go and you buy your garden. You can buy just a garden sprayer. If you're really concerned about the price of a sprayer, I recommend a B&G, but there's like 300 and some dollars, but it's a professional piece of equipment and it'll last for years. Um, but you can get a half gallon B&G too, but why not just get a gallon? I would just get a gallon and mix it half full, but uh, it's six and a half ounces to a, a half gallon because you just divide it in half. Now, typically what I do to mix it too, just to help you if you have any questions about how to mix Usually I'll mix it about half full of water and then I'll, I'll pour the concentrate in, mix it the rest, kind of shake it a little bit, and then mix it up the rest of the way with the rest of the water. 
and then shake it really good, agitate it really well because it's really thick and uh, you want to make sure it's really well mixed so that every ounce of water in that gallon is finished Crossfire Solution. That's what's going to give you the best results. So hopefully this video has helped. I really hope that uh, it's answered some questions. Um, I really needed to do this video so I could at least send it to people if they want to know, you know, what they need to do and how they need to do it. If you need a video on how to actually treat with Crossfire, I'm going to link that video. Don't forget in the comments below, click it, take a look. It's like 14 minutes long. It's not a very long one. And uh, hopefully this will help you guys. Also, I want to thank my Patreon, Jabron Fuller. Uh, he's the only Patreon I've got. He, he pledges money every month to help needy families in Virginia where I treat uh, homes uh, yeah, at a very, very steep discounted rate to try to help people who can't afford bed bug treatments to be able to get what they need. So they quit getting bit, their children quit getting bit, and they can live in peace. So I really appreciate it, Jabron. You guys, you're a really great guy. I really appreciate it. You guys have a really great evening. And hopefully this has helped. Thanks.